Top 10 Scariest 5 Nights at Freddy's Animatronics Number 10. Night Marion Night Marion is the nightmare version of Marionette. He made his debut in Five Nights at Freddy's 4. Night Marion reminds a lot of fans of the infamous Slenderman because of his long limbs and sickly appearance. His beady white eyes, large permanent smile, and the razor-sharp teeth that line it sends players in a panic when he appears in the hallways. What make Night Marion the most scary is that he can choose to attack from any spot in the game. This makes players always look out for him, as you never know where he will strike from next. Night Marion has a deep voice that's filled with vengeance, and when his voice starts to malfunction it just adds to the creepiness level. Number 9. Golden Freddy Golden Freddy is one of the original five animatronics from the first game. Golden Freddy looks like Freddy Fazbear, but instead he is yellow in color and is missing both his eyes. Golden Freddy has many conspiracy theories about him and his rare appearances in the game, but when he does appear he makes you jump back in your seat. What makes him so scary is that when he appears, it is in few second flashes on screen and then he disappears. He can also enter your office with both doors closed making a terrifying appearance when you look up from the cameras. If you get a jump scare from this animatronic, the game will crash and no game over screen is presented. At Number 8. Springtrap. Springtrap has the most intense and gruesome backstory in the series. He appears in Five Nights at Freddy's 3 and has the corpse of his creator William Afton inside him. Springtrap is an animatronic rabbit that is tattered and broken down. What makes Springtrap most terrifying is his human-like movements. He just walks up to players in flowy human-like fashion, all the while his creator's corpse is along for the ride. Some promotional images from Five Nights at Freddy's 3 show Afton's decaying corpse falling out of Springtrap's mouth. Number 7. Withered Bonnie. The second game in the series marks the appearance of Withered Bonnie. This is the damaged version of Bonnie from the first game. Withered Bonnie has no face, one arm and red eyes that seem to stare deep into your soul. Withered Bonnie hides in the vents, appears in the office and causes the lights to flicker and the audio to distort when he appears. Scott Cawthon, the game series creator has even said that he considers Bonnie the scariest animatronic in the games and has had multiple nightmares about him. At Number 6. Ennard. Five Nights at Freddy's, sister location, saw the debut of an animatronic named Ennard. Ennard is particularly scary in the fact that he is made up of parts from different animatronics. He has a clown mask for a face and multiple animatronic eyes throughout his body. Ennard is one of the taller animatronics, standing at 6 feet 2 inches. What makes him creepy is that Ennard has a goal to leave the restaurant. He is hoping to achieve this by scooping out the player's insides and taking their place pretending to be human. Number 5. Circus Baby. Also in sister location, Circus Baby makes her debut. She looks like a clown and was built by William Afton to trap and kill children. When Circus Baby gets a child alone, a claw in her stomach would open and pull the child inside. Circus Baby's voice is soft and childlike, which makes a lot of players creeped out. It is said that Afton's daughter Elizabeth was killed by Baby, and now her spurt hunts the animatronic. Number 4. Shadow Bonnie. Another version of Bonnie makes the list. Shadow Bonnie appears in Five Nights at Freddy's 2. This is a dark silhouette of the toy Bonnie animatronic. Shadow Bonnie stands in the back left corner of the office and his glowing white eyes and teeth are the only real feature you can make out. Don't stare at Shadow Bonnie too long, doing so will cause the game to freeze or crash completely. Number 3. Scrap Baby. Scrap Baby is a recycled version of Circus Baby. This animatronic appears in Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator and is very unsettling. Scrap Baby has a giant claw for an arm and traded in her shoes for a pair of roller skates. She sits there as you're checking her, looking straight at you and sending shivers down your spine. Scrap Baby will move slightly when you put the paper up and make you second-guess yourself. She can also travel through the vents and give you a good scare. Number 2. Nightmare Mangle. In Five Nights at Freddy's 4, Nightmare Mangle makes their appearance. 
Nightmare Mangle is the nightmare version of Mangle from the second game. They have razor-sharp teeth, an exposed endoskeleton, and one glowing yellow eye. The original Mangle can be seen as just a head and bow tie. Nightmare Mangle is loud and emits radio static from its hiding place in the closet. Nightmare Mangle never appears in the hallways, but you always feel an eye on you as they watch you from the closet door. And at number 1. Nightmare. Nightmare is also from Five Nights at Freddy's 4 and just like the name suggests he is a nightmare. Most fans agree that Nightmare is the scariest animatronic. Nightmare is a version of Nightmare Fredbear, but recolored. He is all black with red eyes and tons of sharp teeth. Nightmare can appear anywhere in the game like Nightmarian, his appearance and game mechanics make him the scariest Five Nights at Freddy's animatronic of all time. That was top 10 scariest 5 nights at Freddy's animatronics. Thanks for watching.